Hello, my name is Matthew Gorton, and I'm with the Vermont Reptile and Amphibian Atlas. So while we were out doing turtle survey work, looking for rare turtles in Vermont, we caught some snapping turtles and thought this would be a good opportunity to show how comfortable we are being in the water with snapping turtles. Some people have expressed concerns about having snapping turtles in their swimming ponds. Our response is that snapping turtles, while in the water, are not defensive or aggressive and will try to get away. For that reason, there is no need to worry about swimming with snapping turtles. Also, we would like to note that no turtles were harmed during our surveys and all caught turtles were released unharmed. So what I wanted really to show is that a lot of people are nervous or I should say I get emails about people that are nervous swimming in the same pond with snapping turtles or the same river or lake and, and I tell them you know any of us here in the state that have been swimming outside of a swimming pool we've been swimming with snapping turtles and you can just see that once they're in the water they're not defensive or aggressive this turtle now knows that he or she is almost free and and I'm standing right here obviously in the water with it and uh, I do want to keep my hands away from the head, but once I let it go, I'm not nervous about this turtle. It's just going to leave. It's just going to take off. Now, it's a big turtle. I hope you can see that. Uh, uh, so I'm just going to let it go. It's going to take off. You can see the, see the bubbles here. In the water, that's what they're going to do, just like fish. They're going to try to get away from you. And they're not going to attack you. You're not looking like food, particularly when you're in like I am. I'm way too big for food. I'm just a potential threat, and they want to get away. So, you know. Women are being a same body water step turtle, just not a risk. Nothing that you really have to be concerned about, unless maybe you were to dangle your little finger or your little toe right in front of them and make it look like food. So I just want you to get a chance to see that. Uh, and by the way, if you get this email and my wife says I haven't made it home, I'm probably still stuck out here. Unless Matt is kind enough to help you out. <laughs> Probably not. 